Ladies and gentlemen, welcome here to the transition of authority ceremony between Task Force Gator and Task Force Orion. The ceremonies like this, transitions of authority, they're a good time to reflect. First, I'll remember your TOA ceremony. It was cold. I remember thinking, how are these Floridians going to handle a cold Ukrainian winter? However, we're thankful that you integrated well, and by early January, you were beginning your first training in that cold Ukrainian winter, training on Javelin, Stinger, and Bunker Busters. In conclusion, I think it's important to talk about one last memory. For Colonel Murphy and Task Force Orion, know that this command will we remember you. As the first unit to be recidivist in the training or in JMTGU, it is absolutely great to have you back here. We remember what you did on your previous rotation, you left an impact on all of us here in 7th ATC, and you left an impact on the armed forces of Ukraine that you trained. The last nine months have been incredible, emotional, rewarding, difficult, but most of all, it's been an honor. Task Force Orion, today as a team we assume authority of the JMTGU, a mission we stand ready to prepare to execute, a mission whose success is not measured by matrices, but our ability to increase the proficiency of our Ukraine partners in their lethality and survivability as they defend their country against Russian hostilities. I know each one of us understands the urgency of this mission and the gravity of what the Ukraine people have at stake. Finally, to our Ukrainian brothers and sisters in arms, who I know are training in the field, fighting in their homeland, and are no longer among us, we remain relentless in our support, focused in our training, and tireless in our effort. We will not let you down.